All right, here we go. Getting real into finding those perfect basketball camps today. We're on module seven, smack dab in the middle of our step three, gather step, navigating today, national elite and showcase camps. Before we get into that and what we're going to do today, let's quickly recap college basketball camps in our last module. We navigated college sports websites and showed you where to look to find basketball camps. We discussed why you should check out the smaller colleges and universities in addition to the larger schools. Really just went over tips I picked up over the last few years, handful of years, for camps and navigating those pesky college camp websites. And today, Game 7, or Game 7 of the NBA Finals, no, Module 7 Game Plan, we're going to be covering a lot today, a lot of websites, a lot of new info. Remember, national camps are around the country. Elite are for advanced instruction and showcase, also called exposure camps. Those names are interchangeable. Our camps to get recognized by college scouts. I combined national and elite together because elite camps are becoming more and more like national camps. Elite camps are creating programs for middle school ages in addition to high schoolers. They're really trying to expand their business, and it's good for the young kids who are getting better at basketball at a younger age. It's just great for the game because people are learning those fundamentals, those good skills that they need for advanced basketball, getting that at an earlier age. Showcase is gaining popularity as well. It's a camp that I want you to know about in case your son or daughter has interest in it, if they get to that level of their game, and I hope they do. So we're going to go over that and show you the differences between all the sites. Today's rookie mistake, sending your son or daughter to a showcase or exposure camp too early. A question I get a lot from parents is, should I send my son or daughter to a showcase camp, and at what age should I send them? Are they ready for it? I really think where I come down on this, I really think showcase and exposure camps should be for the college-bound player in middle to late high school. Instead of spending money for a 7th or 8th grader to go to a showcase camp, consider an advanced skill development camp instead. Attend the, an advanced camp like the elite ones we're going to go over or, the, or other ones you can find on youth basketball camps or consider hiring a personal basketball trainer to provide some individual instruction. I know it's really cool and feels good to be listed online as a top player from a showcase camp, but resist the urge and see the bigger picture. The bigger picture is trying to get into college, and the number one way to do that is to have a great game, to have a great basketball game, do really well in high school, increase that basketball IQ, and do those little things that college coaches really find important. Some of the pros of attending a showcase camp would be to play against other elite players in the area. You'll get great competition, but at the same time, that could also be a con because if you've ever been around players who are trying to show off, who have the elite skills, there's not a lot of team basketball going on, and if you're not really aggressive, you could spend three days just running around the court, passing the ball around, getting up a couple shots because Players are trying to show off as ball hogging. It may not be like that at every showcase camp, but the ones that I've been to have had some of that going on. Another pro to a showcase camp, it's not all bad, there are pros. Maybe it might be a good place to get recognized by an AAU coach or a competitive team because there are those good players there. So scouts for not colleges, but the competitive AU teams may be there, and you may be able to get picked up by a team over there. So that was our quick introduction. Now we're going to go ahead and get into that screen share, show you some really cool websites about the National Showcase and Elite Camps. Let's go ahead and jump right in there. All right, here we go. We're starting off on youthbasketballcamps.com, National Basketball Camps page. You're going to see we're the popular national camps, Nike, Point Guard College, Breakthrough. We're going to go to all those sites today. Scroll down, you'll see all of the all-around great national camps. And let's go through a couple of these real quick. 
Nike is actually under an umbrella company called USSC. It's U.S. Sports Camps. Uh, Nike, NBC are both under them. McCracken is more Midwest basketball camps. Or, yeah, Midwest basketball camps. Snow Valley is in California. Ben is in New England. And what's really nice is you can go through these camps and read about them, or you can just go up here. And let's say you live in, somewhere around Atlanta, and we'll use the Atlanta zip code here. 30301, 100 miles, you look for camps 100 miles away. You can look for all kinds of sports if you have a camper who's interested in some other sport as well, maybe anything from water polo to rugby to running, or another son or daughter who may be interested in. But for today, we're going to use basketball Go ahead and search that, and then boom, we have all the camps here in the 100-mile radius of that area code, and you can see down, you can scroll down, you can click on the ones in your area and see <clears throat> what's available, or you can just go down here and see you got Nike girls, boys, boys, lots of boys, Nike boys camps and girls. Looks like no other camps, no other NBC but it's a really cool feature, easy way to search. Really hit several birds with one stone here. Type in your zip code, you can adjust it if you wanna go a little bit farther out, change your sport and research. That's a really great tool. I use it to find camps in certain areas and you can see where these are if you wanna travel, maybe you live a little bit out, out of the city and then you can click on these to get into the camp and read more about that specific camp because every camp is going to be a little bit different. This is Coach Ford, founder of Smart Hoops. Everything's going to be a little bit different. You can read about that coach right there, get a lot of great information. I provide a lot of the general information about a camp like Nike, but you really need to go in as well and, and read the camp details. Here you go, just lots of excellent information, discounts. So that's what you could go through and, and do that search for NBC and Nike two great national camps. Advantage right here is another one you can find through my site. If you're looking for your lo ton of information about the camp, but we're just gonna go through the locations to see, show you where you can see if there's a camp. Let's say you live in California, and then you can just scroll down and see a ton of basketball camps in California all over the place. There's Looks like there's about 50 of them. And you can see what's in your area, and they have different kinds, and you can see ball handling, basketball shooting, three-day camp. <clears throat> Another camp I recently found, and I want to show you guys because it's a pretty cool camp. It's one-on-one. -on -one. Let's say you live in Houston, Texas, and you can scroll down, learn a little bit about the program in Houston, and you have camps. But not just summer camps, but winter, spring, fall, and summer, all in that area, plus classes and clinics for weekend, private lessons, after school, they provide a really great all-around program year-round. So it's not just the summer, but after school, winter break, whatever. And you can see they're doing two-ball dribbling with some ladder work there. Great stuff. Next, we're going to be moving on, and we're going to be really doing breakthrough basketball, which is starting to get in that borderline elite and national camp. Breakthrough, you can see here, obviously, a national camp. They have, na they have camps all over the place. Let's just zoom in here to see if you lived, let's say you lived in Chicago. You zoom in here, you click on one of these. And in Chicago, they actually have three different camps, dates all over the place. An elite car guard camp, that's where you get the elite youth skills, that's where you get the beginner, fourth to ninth grade, seventh to twelfth grade. Also right there, a little bit more elite, it's a specialized camp for offense, attack and counter, and that's actually in October. That's not even during the summer, so you have a wide range of camps for, by them as well. But you can use this, see all the states right here, lots and lots of options. Use this map right through youth basketball camps to find out the camps in your area through that website. Point Guard College, now we're really borderline on elite camps. Wealth of knowledge on this website, huge wealth of knowledge. You can, why, is, why PGC, who is it for, what to expect, details, courses, all the different courses available for kids of all ages, and I say kids, but some are post 
high school clinics, and then there's a great section for parents right here. I also recommend if you go to who is PGC4 up here, take this little 30 second test if you're on the fence and you're you don't know if it's for you, they really walk you through it. But for our purposes, you could do a search right here, type in your address, region, what course you want. I like to go here to schedule and locations under courses, it has a nice map and will provide some more information about all the different courses that are available in the area. Let's say you lived in California. You could zoom right in there. Zoom right in there. Los Angeles, you can click Point Guard College right here. You can see the date. You got here a prep school, which will be definitely elite. And if you click register now, it will take you to that page and you can learn even more about that course. 110% money back guarantee. That's how good that this course is. Lots of information. You could spend hours on these websites learning about all the stuff they have on oh, that's available. And if you're going to make that investment, I recommend learning about it so you can get the most out of it, whether for parents and your son or daughter as well. Last elite camp we're going to touch on here, IMG Academy. It's only in Bradenton, Florida, but if you're looking for elite camps, this is the place to go. We'll go here just to the boys' basketball camps. You can see up here there's a ton of links, the private school, post-grad, after you graduate high school, if you're still looking for training, and then the youth, bas the youth camps where we went. For boys' basketball, you, they have weekly camps. They have camps that are multi-week leagues, big man camps, holiday and specialty camps, so much information here. You can scroll around and read, again, spend hours reading about it. And if you're making this investment, which could be a several thousand dollar investment, definitely want to read about it. Weekly, multi-week camps here, they break it down, what's going on. And then something pretty cool here I saw at the end. They show that how your skills change as you train for longer throughout their program. And then the different programs they have, core, total athlete, game changer, how personalized it is, and then group pricing with discounts. A lot of information. Just want you to check it out because this is really the cream of the crop. Even if you're not ready for it or maybe you don't think you're interested in making that investment, it's still good to know about what's out there and you can compare what you're signing up for to some of the best stuff that's some of the best camps that are out there. So that'll wrap up Elite. Now we'll do some showcase i'll show you you can click here on youth basketball camps go back to the elite find some of these camps and down here is exposure camp here we go we've got a couple we're going to shoot show you a future 150 and then rick bolus's camp future 150 this is what it's going to look like you can sign up for these camps pretty affordable compared to many of the camps and then you can click on them to read more and then they also have something like you can go to some of these. What I've seen in a lot of some of these exposure camps is they'll have regional camps, and if you do really well, then you'll get invited to the next one. I've been I've seen a lot of that. And then go ahead. You can we'll see all these exposure camps have their rankings listed online. Again, these are these are pretty elite players. They've already committed to all these schools. Duke number one player committed to LSU and you can go all the way down to 2018 class of high school class of 2018 high school class of 2019 that's still pretty far away but they have these rankings for these kids and then they get you to pay some more to see if you're ranked there if you're below the 15th but you go to these camps and then you can oh they even have 2020 look at that getting real young here I'd say when you're getting into this 2020 which is five years away these kids are pretty young really invest in those really invest it's fun to do the showcase camps but invest in the basketball iq another exposure camp i'm not sure how young this 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 one goes but it's a really well known one they have rankings as well but you'll see here they have hundreds and hundreds of players i mean i could scroll it could take us a day to read all these names and locations, all these different players and 
They're located in Kentucky and Florida. Great camp for the East Coast if you're interested. Again, on this website, a wealth of knowledge about what's going on here, about why you go, why would you go to their exposure camp testimonials. But like most exposures, they're going to have the elite training. They're going to have the player rankings. And if you're interested in that, continue reading. Lots and lots of info. But that'll wrap up our national elite showcase camp. Showed you around a couple of them. If you're interested in any of those different types, definitely recommend getting into those websites and reading about them, and you can find them all on youthbasketballcamps.com. We're going to go ahead and wrap up this module, though, in the slides. Okay, here we are back in the slides, wrapping up our module. That will do it for those National Elite and Showcase camps. We navigated some of the most popular National Elite camps out there. You may be considering it if... Uh, if they're in your area, go to the same places we looked at just now to see if there's any discussed showcase camps as well. And when your son or daughter might not be interested in these just yet or ready for them, but keep them on the radar down the road if you're getting into crunch time and you're trying to get some uh, exposure to those colleges. And like we, we saw, many of those camps, there's year-round training. So this is definitely when you get into those national and elite camps, this is not just a summer camp. This is all year round. So plenty of time to find those camps. If you're not ready for summer, maybe during the winter, maybe on a weekend when you have a weekend available, check them out, hit them up for some advanced training. Up next, doing the Google search the right way. I'm going to show you how to successfully do a search for basketball camps. I know, I know you probably, or you definitely know how to do a Google search. But it gets more complicated than that when you get all the information about the camps. It gets messy, a little confusing. Some of it's outdated. I'll show you, give you some tips on how to save that time. We'll do the screen share just like we've done in the last few modules. I'll hold your hand through the whole process, show you the things that I've picked up over the last handful of years doing Google searches for basketball camps. Excited for that module because we're going to save lots of time with some of these tips. And I will see you in the module.